Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Jeff Davis here with the Colorado Avalanche Information Center. I'm currently in the North San Juan zone on Red Mountain Pass on a north northeast facing slope at around 11,200 feet. There's a big storm approaching the San Juans, forecast to bring up to two inches of water and over 20 inches of snow to the area. My question today is how much load will our early season and fragile snowpack be able to hold? Though I haven't found much slab in the upper snowpacks I've traveled to this point, I have observed some larger grain facets and signs of early season depth or on the ground. You're most likely to find this week later on north and east facing slopes that harbored early season snow. I just did a long column test and got a very easy failure. As snow accumulates over the next few days, avalanche danger is going to rise and our ability to trigger avalanches is going to increase and we could see our first round of natural avalanche activity for the 2019-2020 season. When you're out in the backcountry, watch for those obvious signs of instability, including other avalanche activity, cracking, collapsing, and the sound of whooping. It's best to stick to low angle slopes as the snowpack adjusts to this new load. Have fun, be safe, and welcome back winter.